star spawn. Well, Cthulhu's species literally has star in its name, so we know they're from outer space, and here they are. Their bonus is plunge. When you move, you can go two spaces if you want, skipping in between areas. You can see the utility of this, I'm sure, right away. Their second ability is the victory ability. The stars are right. Well, it turns out that their super unit is the Cthulhu, of course. Now, you may wonder, why does he have two Cthulhus? Well, it's because after Cthulhu conquered Earth, he underwent mitosis, and now there's two. See? Maybe it's a whole function of coming to Earth. Anyway, when you build one of your Cthulhus, you get a secret. It doesn't happen when you salvage one, or you get it some other way. But each time you build a Cthulhu, you get a secret. Slumber is your, is your weakness. It's a key action that gives you an organic, a metal, and an atomic. Uh, when you do the slumber action, you take one of your three slumber tokens and you put it in your pool. At the end of the game, each slumber token you still have in your storage costs you a victory point. So you get a slight monetary reward for it, which is kind of cool, but it's quite awkward often to be spending time slumbering instead of doing your actions. Your special abilities are Devour and Regenerate. Regenerate lets you pay one atomic when you salvage. Why would you do that, you wonder? It's because when you salvage using Regenerate, you don't, it's not a, a key action, it's an extra action, so you can do it and not take any time. Your Devour ability happens before a battle. Before the battle, the enemy must pick one of his units to be killed before it rolls dice. Sort of like the Cthulhu Devourer ability from Cthulhu Wars, except it can work with any of your units, because really all of your units are Cthulhus in a sense. So, that is the star spawn. The Cthulhu's ability as a super unit is that, and it's terrifying, an enemy can't move a unit into a system with a Cthulhu unless he pays you a hyper token, because it's so scary. So, if he pays the hyper token, hey, you got a hyper token, and if he doesn't, then Cthulhu has effectively protected the system from an attack. <laughs>